boy will back with another video today in this video i'll be talking about solana ticker symbol sol solana is crashing right now i'm gonna give you guys a couple levels so buying levels looking to buy new support levels new resistance levels and one key level i'm looking to load the boat on if we can get down to the level okay it will be a little far from where it is now not too far but a little distance if we get down to that level, I'll be loading, loading heavy, okay? So make sure you guys smash the like button. Subscribe if you are new. Trying to get over 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I know you guys can do it. And turn on your post notifications. Now, with Solana, we'll jump right into it. These are the old levels, okay? Warning level, around 200. Buying level I was looking to buy, around 208. And resistance level I was looking to exit for that scalp, right? So let's go ahead and go down real quick. What happened at that buying level? Okay, so price dropped, right? Price dropped, had that little bounce right here. Okay, had a little bounce, rose up. So buying pressure came in right where I was expecting it. Okay, buying pressure came in. You wait for confirmation, fell down. No confirmation came in here to actually buy. Okay, so I did not buy which is a good thing we didn't because look at the drop that came right after. Okay, so that's why you always wait for confirmation and that's why I try to make uh, the videos for you guys to give you guys the best levels possible. So that right there told us not to buy. Great, let's take this off. Now let's go to the warning level, okay? This warning level held support once, almost twice, broke, okay? After that break, look what happened. Price dropped, came back up, almost acted as resistance again okay so a couple levels that i'm kind of looking at now for solana that we really want to be mindful of let's see i'll give you guys a level right around so this warning level is at 200 i'll give you guys a resistance level that we can expect some more some new resistance I would say right around like 20, 204 to 205 is a new resistance level. If there was a way, I'll just put it in the middle, like 204. Yeah, just put it like kind of in the middle right there. So around 204, 50, kind of in the middle right here, between 205 to 204, I'm expecting some resistance to come in the market right there. So that's something that you want to be mindful of. That's the first level. Warning level is around 200. What I think we're going to do is, since that kind of already broke, I think we're going to move that warning level to around 184. So let's move this level to around 184. This is around the new warning level that we need to be looking at. 180 we'll leave it right there okay so that's around the new warning level that i'm kind of looking at around 184 if that 184 level breaks okay the level that i will be buying heavy at we need to go to the four hour chart the level that i need that i will be buying heavy at is 165 So let's put a level at 165, 165, right here, okay? This is the level that I will be buying heavy at. Let's turn that level green. That is where I really want to buy for um, like loading the boat up, right? So really trying to buy a full position at this 165 level. If it gets down there to that 165 level, this is why I say make sure you guys get your Webull account link down below. I think it should be the first link in the description because once we reach to about a thousand subscribers, I'll be letting you guys know when exactly I'm buying outside of the videos. Okay, so I'll be letting you guys exactly know when I'm buying, how much I'm buying per crypto that I do buy. Okay, so let's get over a thousand subscribers. So, big buying level right here around 165. That's first. If we get down here, 
it looks like we will get down here so i just want to have you guys prepare 165 huge buying level warning level if this level breaks around 184.50 185 expect 165 to be hit okay if price rebounds from here expect resistance around 204 205 okay if this resistance breaks then what we'll do is if that resistance breaks we're going to turn that resistance into a buying level okay so if this resistance breaks price comes up like this say price comes up like this right so resistance is broken what we're going to be doing is we're going to be waiting for a pullback you guys a new note i love pullbacks okay we're gonna wait for a pullback in this area it doesn't have to be that exact level we just need a pullback okay then we can buy here to see prices go higher okay once this happens i'll give you guys an exit level but for right now i, I want you mainly focus on this acting as a resistance since it is kind of bearish right now for solana if there is options for solana and i can get puts i would get puts when it came up here okay because i do feel like it's a little heavier right now and it's gonna break this warning level but these are the main three levels that I was kind of wanting you guys to watch out for because this will tell you where it's going to go. If it's breaking this, then uh, imagine, picture the 165 to where it's going. If it breaks this, then I think we might see higher 200s, okay? So kind of just watch out for those two levels. I'll keep updating you guys on Solana. Just let me know what cryptos you guys are looking at in the comment section below. And let me know if you like these consistent updates on these cryptos, okay? So thank you for all the love on the channel. Don't forget to get your Webull account, first link in the description. And always remember, no trade recommendation to buy or sell anything, just for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.